Hi, welcome to Equator. In this video, we are going to evaluate polynomials of uh, second and third degree using this sharp scientific calculator ELW516X, ELW516T, and ELW506T. And if you have X and G, that doesn't matter. All of them can do it. So let's get started. So let's say I have a second degree uh, equation x squared minus 5x plus 6 to do in equation mode press mode and go to number 4 equation and now because my maximum polynomial degree is 2 so I'm selecting quadratic so 2 now all these coefficients of x are my a b and c so here a is 1 and here b is minus 5 and then c is 6 so a is 1 and then for minus make sure that you enter this minus so I'm pressing that minus minus 5 and then press equal and then 6 so once you press the, the answer the answer will be x is equal 3 and x is equal 2 so this arrow will take you back it gives you some y minimum and other values which we are not interested in so now let's give you another example now uh, i'm going up just press equal again so in this case now a is 3 b is 3 and y is 2 so now i got answer for x we have one value which is minus 5 plus plus minus so which means we have two values here so minus 5 plus 0 0.64 i which is imaginary and then minus 5 minus 0 0.65 uh, i so we have two values let's go for this one and x squared minus 2x plus 1 so we have 1 and then minus 2 and 1 1 minus 2 and 1 backspace 1 so we got x is equal 1 so we have two x's which is which are 1 so let's go with a third degree so again I have to exit from this mode to do it so press mode 4 and then this time go to cubic function which is 3 now we have a b c and d in this case we have uh, this equation because we don't have to the power 2 so we have 0 x squared plus 4 and then the last value doesn't exist so remember we have another term so we should have four terms here so the values are like that so a is coefficient of this x which is minus 1 and then b is this one which doesn't exist so 0 and c is 4 and d is 0 that's very important I purposely selected that example so you will understand it so I'm pressing lower minus and then 1 equal sign b is 0 c is 4 and then d is 0 now you get three answers so x is minus 2 2 and then 0 so you got three answers for the x so another example which is the last one I'm pressing equal sign in this case these are the coefficient so this equation doesn't have x squared so we have 0 x squared so you have to put it now minus 1 I'm pressing lower minus and then 1 0 and then c is 3 d is minus 5 so now I'm in c is 3 and then minus I'm pressing lower minus and then 5 and I'm getting first answer uh, real number minus 2.27 and then second answer is uh, uh, we have second answer second and third because this has plus minus so it has imaginary 1.13 plus this value i and then 1.13 minus this value this way you can evaluate cubic and quadratic equations using this sharp calculator if you like the video please thumb up and thank you for watching